the, all of the public information about this was suppressed. One of the biggest things about the lost labyrinth of Egypt, it was one of the ancient wonders of the world. And Herodotus described it as exceeding in splendor and wonder that of the pyramids. The labyrinth was this thousand room structure that was absolutely magnificent. You could have fit all of the temples of Karnak and Luxor and all of the temples of Egypt into its footprint. It was underground, it had multiple levels. There's all these historical accounts of people visiting it and just being awed like massive granite blocks and structures and temples. It's this huge thing that was just lost to the sands of time. But a guy named Louis de Cordier did something called the Matahar Expedition. I think it was 2008. He went in and he had partnership with Egyptian Department of Antiquities and they went and did ground penetrating radar and his other acoustic tests and a whole bunch of different tests at Hawara. And they found it. It was spread out across like multiple football fields along all sides of this pyramid and on all sides of this canal. The thing is absolutely massive. They found all this granite and, and these labyrinth line like structures under the ground. And unfortunately, his entire report and 